We have results now from Virginia's 4th District. As you can see, Randy Forbes had no problem maintaining his seat in the 4th District. That's right. Ten of your sides, Liz Palka is live now with Randy Forbes' campaign in Chesapeake. Liz. Well, Nicole, there was a big crowd here at the Chesapeake Republican celebrations for Randy Forbes. Let's take you straight to this video of when the congressman arrived here at the party that was held at Traditions at Chesapeake Golf Club tonight. He was hugging people, shaking hands with many. Of course, this is his hometown, so he knows a lot of people. He told me as he was out in the 4th District today campaigning, he was talking to voters. He said they are upset. They want new direction from leaders in Washington. Washington. So I asked him, what are you going to do to make sure voters get what they want? We've got to create a new kind of civility where we can talk to each other and try to find where we all agree instead of this politics of trying to, to be full of hatred and divisiveness and stuff that just seems to permeate the country today. I think if we do that, we're going to be surprised at how many things we agree on to get this thing back on track. That's what I hope we'll, we'll see happening in Washington. Not going to be easy, but we can do it. And Congressman Forbes thanked his family. They were here today, as well as several Chesapeake elected officials. As for the congressman, he tells us he's heading back to Washington in the next week. Live in Chesapeake, I'm Liz Palka, 10 on your side.